You know, for 11-bit studios, this sort of intro is to be expected. Let me just turn the music down slightly. Holy Jesus shit is it loud. G'day mates and welcome to Frostpunk. To start with, I already enjoy this. And Desmond, London Refugee, Mother Claire. Look, let's just... Okay, that's better. Right, I have just skipped straight into the intro because I was getting really annoyed by how loud that music was. This is Frostpunk, and it's by 11-Bit, the same people who made This War of Mine. For those who don't know what that was, it was a depressing game about being civilians in a Bosnian-like war, basically sitting in a city under siege. Uh, it, it was a fun game in some senses, but once you got past the theme, it certainly became a sub-par survival game. It was okay, but there was very clearly a best way to play. We roam uh, a still, cold world. Well then. No horizon in sight. The rulers of old, stripped of pride and glory. It feels as yesterday we were turning the wheels of progress. Until the frost stopped it all. Suddenly, without a warning. When tides had changed, they changed for all of us, no matter wealth or class. We have lost our world to snow, and with it, our last traces of humanity. Farewell to plenty. And for those who remained, came the time to adapt. We decided to leave our homes and head north. We roamed for weeks, maybe months, leaving behind all the things we once believed had made us. It was hope pushed us forward, slowly, step by step. We knew the cost of our journey, and we paid the price a hundred times. Finally, the time has come to build the last city on Earth. Holy shit. That is one hell of a way to open. So I was about to say, I've seen a bit of this game, but I've not yet played it. This is my first time around. And if you want to see more of this, let me know, and I will happily do a series. I might just do a series on it anyway, because this is looking great. But the point is, again, the world has frozen over. You have this giant furnace. I don't know why they went north, though. It looked nuts that they crossed the sea. So... We fled from London and crossed the sea to reach the frozen north. On the way, our convoy was hit by a blizzard and scattered. A handful has managed to reach the site of this generator, only to find it frozen solid and abandoned. Why is no one here? Did any of our people survive the blizzard? Are there others out there? Whatever we do, we should expect the worst now that the world as we know it has crumbled. Surely you would still head for the equator. That would make sense. Why would you head north? There's nothing, like, there's not even resources up north. Why would you... Hmm. That doesn't make a lot... I hope there's a reason. Unless, unless they were hoping for, like, day round sun or something. Is there still night? Whatever. So the point of the game is you get this little generator, you have to run a city, and shit doesn't go well. And it gets very depressing quickly. So we need to get the generator working. It provides heat and power to the other buildings. Without it, we'll freeze. Stop all some coal and start the generator. Oh, it's always nice to get a WASD game. Oh boy. So, to start with, we need to turn on the, uh, things. That means we need to get some people getting coal, I think. Where is it? Where is coal? No, that's wooden crates. Is that coal? Coal pile, right. I need to assign some workers to this. So, what does assigning engineers do? I guess they're just better workers? Yeah, they're probably just better workers. Alright. We're gonna get some coal rolling in, because we're gonna need that shit. Uh, I think we are pausing right now, aren't we? 
Yep, yeah, there we go, we are, alright. So, beautiful camera controls, already know how to do that, mate, worry not. Actually, shit, I probably should check this real quick. Oh, is there a way to rotate? Q&E, right, for some reason, oh yeah, my mouse does work, that wasn't working at first, whatever. So they want 200 coal to start off with, let's just get most of our guys focused in on uh, getting coal, and we're just going to max that stuff out. We've got unemployed, we've got uh, 15 children prohibited. Oh, don't, don't you worry. I already know there's a vent that gets children working for you. Get them off their lazy bloody asses. Alright, we'll get some guys harvesting wood to begin with as well. And some metal. We'll go for the rest of the coal here. Get five engines on it. Much the same here. Oh, here we go. Five. Five, that should be doing... Okay, we've got, what, 15 workers all over left. Is there anything we actually want? Sawmills? I'm trying to like see if there's anything else that we might want. Let's see, let's turn on time a bit, here we go. I do love this where they sort of forge their way through, like look at that, look at that. They're sort of pushing their way through the snow. Oh, looks so cool. I did, I love the design of the generator, but I thought like, what happened to the treads of the, uh, of the thing? Because that's what they were walking with this, weren't they? What happened to like the body of it? I do, I hope they go more into the story. I hope the game isn't just this. I hope the game, like, talks about the story more. Because, man, I'd love to see it. I know you can, like, head out and, like, venture out and explore, but... On top of that, how is... How is this, like, our city? How does... How do people get in? Can we... Hang on. No, we we just legitimately... You can't get in here. This is just a giant hole in the ground. I'm so confused. Alright. Resource management is crucial. You need coal to power the generator, wood and steel are necessary construction. Steam calls are part of advanced buildings. Raw food is used to produce food rations. Right. Most buildings require you assign people to work there. Certain buildings only employ engineers and other employ workers. Cool. That's fine by me. Controlling time, we know exactly what that does. And constructing things. So build streets and construct buildings. Right. Uh, the uh, buildings inside the heat zone are warmer and provide better living and working conditions. That's right. To make the best use of the heat zone, buildings are placed on a radial grid. Yep. Okay, beautiful. So pretty much, the way this uh, sort of city building works here, I do like how loud it is up here though. I guess that might be why they came here, from like shelter from the blizzards. And if that was like a, the problem. Here we go, lack of shelter. Okay, so let's here we go. Let's pause up. Let's build some, uh, some housing. So thinly insulated shel shelters. Beautiful. So we're gonna go. I, I do love this little design. It feels very city skylines esque. But hang on, how many? How much? Uh, Ten people to sleep in. So that's three. That's thirty. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do like a double layer here, and then we're going to build. Oh, we, I tr oh wait, no. Here we go. Let's build a street. Right. Oh, I really like this design mechanic actually. Oh, can you? Hang on. Can you? I'm trying to figure out if I can. Oh, I just I don't have the wood to build it. Okay, right. But there you go, you can like sort of build them like that. Oh, activate the generator, here we go. Uh, steam level one. Love the look at this thing. Can we, can we see? Oh, trying to like very slightly get a view in the top. Anyway, let's get a temperature overlay. Oh, oh boy, that's beautiful. Oh my god, that looks really fucking cool. Wow, that looks cool. All right. Anyway, so you have different range settings that you set it on. Uh, you can put it to overdrive as well. You can t keep turning it up, right? You t turn up the area and how much you're actually heating it. Uh, stress level, the game will explode and end. But there you go, we've sort of warmed the area slightly around here. There we go. Very low risk of getting ill. Perfect. We've got the Book of Laws. Ah, that's right where we start to make our choices, don't we? Find ways to battle. Oh, here we go. So yeah, child la- yeah, I've seen this. Child labor, safe jobs, child shelters. Oh, okay. we can just start signing this, can't we? Okay, so ch children can work in uh, safe workplaces. Uh, hope will fall slightly. Children work as we injured in accidents. Or, uh, child shelter. Providing all children with a place in child shelter gives a permanent hope bonus. You'll have to build a charge child shelter. That's not a terrible idea. We could actually... Uh, I kind of like the idea of putting uh, kids to work, though. Cemetery. No risk of disease. No risk of disease, you'll have to dig a snow pit, hope will fall, discontent will rise, you'll have to establish- I think we want to burn bodies, won't we? It's basically like, do we want to either go for, um, you know, like, a, you know, a normal version, hey look, this is good, or do you want to go like, the fucked up version, and we get more stuff out of it, right? Oh, I like it's just the fighting arena, nice. Nice, let's, um, fuck it, let's build a fighting arena, because that makes perfect sense, immediately, do it. Beautiful. 
A new law? Okay, so this gives us the different places we can work from. There's no food processing currently. That's a problem. So we need to figure out some food. And we need to uh, keep harvesting from elsewhere. Let's probably, like... Let's get some more workers on these. Some engines on these as well. Just get some more wooden uh, stuff flowing in. Right, now. Food. Cookhouse, no. Maybe health, no. Is there anything... Oh, we just need resources. All right, I'm going to cut back on my uh, coal production for now. I'm going to keep getting wood and steel. Because we are going to bloody well need it. Okay, we've got 10 workers left. Right, 80 homeless people currently. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. These guys... Oh, of course, right, we need workers to actually go build this shit, don't we? Um, okay, so the way... It, oh, wow. The way it works is people who are not currently at work... Here we go. The generator hums with reassuring warmth. We shouldn't take it for granted. If the generator goes down, the city dies. Be mindful of coal reserves. Now food, there'll be no city if we starve to death. Just find a, a secure way to find provide raw food and build a cookhouse to prepare further meals. Right. Good. Betting on fights to the next thing to the uh, next best things to the races, says Patrice Vernon, obviously. Can we Jesus. Alright. Oh right, Pharaoh. Well, here we go. People who are currently not working build buildings. There we go. So we're gonna get a bunch of huts soon. Now, I did want to actually build this next line, but we haven't got enough wood, do we? No. I think we've got plenty of coal. Let's, um, focus on wood production, right? Coal, yeah, look, this pile as well. Pull these guys out. We want wood. Okay, wood's doing fine. Steel's doing fine. We want more wood, though. Here. Max that shit. Hang on. Pull back. Put some there. Engies in. Lovely. What sort of difference do they make? Oh, okay. Engineers make no difference on uh, on wood. All right, so we're gonna pull those out then. And uh, I guess engineers just matter for coal, probably. They give you a bigger bonus there. Hang on here. We'll, we'll pull these workers out then. We'll put all of our engineers into there. Yeah, it gives us eighteen versus fourteen. All right, cool. So engineers want to work in the coal mines. We want to put workers everywhere else. Here we go. All right, it's looking good. Beautiful. Uh-oh, we got two six zero gravely. All right, don't worry. Oh, hang on, we still need some works left over so we can actually get them uh, building buildings and shit. Uh, it's doing fine now. Let's skip through the night. Illness and healthcare. I know, don't worry. Everyone just crowd around here. Oh, God, looking at people wake up is terrifying. Holy shit. I do love all their little outfits, though. Look at this, all the little profile pictures. All right, I know, we, I know we're like in shelter right now, mate, but don't worry. We want to build a little road. Ah, oh, so you can build roads like this. Ah, oh, it's really cool. But we don't have enough fucking wood. Get me my wood, man. I need it. The day-night cycle. Yeah. Why did they go north? Why did they... I, I was looking at that ocean. That was a beautiful shot of seeing them cross the ocean, but... Fuck me, was it terrifying. Like... God, guys. Like, not the not, not best choice, I'll be honest. All right, we need a cookhouse and a hunter's hut. So I'm actually going to build this immediately right here. Cookhouse. And then I'm going to build right next to it a hunter's hut. Lovely. All right. And hopefully... How much have we got? 17. Beautiful. All right, so I'm going to build on... There we go, like so. I've now got another line of, ro of uh, roads so I can start building the new huts. So I'm going to go people, tent. One, two... Ah, and it gets bigger, obviously, as you, oh, obviously, of course, as you go out, you get more and more room to work with. Tent. And then, obviously, we're going to want the fighting arena somewhere. Every night a fight will be here. Let's put it right there. Beautiful. All right, we're out of wood, that's fine. That was a quick day night. Oh, my God, the game runs really quick. Beautiful, hope rises. Can we, uh, do, we can't do a book of laws just yet, don't worry. I want to get children next. I'd, I'd actually probably rather them work. All right, with basic resources now secure, we can try and rescue people we left behind. Build a beacon, scout Frostland, and save as many survivors from our expedition as you can. That's right. Yeah, because you need to actually bring in survivors from the outside. That's how you get more people. Um, we've almost filled up our uh, housing need. We're going to get, like, another house just so we can uh, fit in those who will be, uh, who we like, now coming. So there we go. That'll be fine. How are we doing around here? We've got a hunter's hut. Okay, we need workers to start gathering food. In that case, we're probably going to cut back on the wood production, yeah? Where are we? Steel and wood, steel and wood, steel and wood. Okay, so... Yep, cut back on the wood production for you guys. And instead, we're going to start cooking some meals. Five for you. 
10 for you. Beautiful. So producing 10 food a day. Uh, you need two. Okay, so there we go. That should be fine. We're going to start making some actual food rations. Because our guys are currently starving. What are they starving of? Well, sick if not treated properly. So we need, we need some sort of medical facility. Shit. Uh, health? Medical post. We need 25 wood. Alright, that's the way we solve this. Come on, guys. Wake up. Needs to hit the next day. Oh, introduce new law. Okay, I want to I want to get children working. I'm sick of this shit. Children, you've got to do your jobs. All right, emergency shift maybe. No, I don't. I don't really want that. Um, unless maybe sustain life. Okay, we can't cure the gravely ill. Or the gravely ill, but we can keep them alive. Right. So they will be not treated and remain a burden. No, that's terrible. Um, we can basically like super treat the gravely ill. And what that means is that they will be treated medical posts, and hope will rise slightly, but they may end up be, uh, being amputees. Which is honestly probably a better choice. Unless... Okay, let's look at, let's look at this. A permanent hope bonus, but uh, I don't know, I just I feel like... Hmm... I feel like for now child labor is a, is a good choice, right? We, we can't really... I don't know, I don't know, like... It feels to me right now that child shelter is a nice idea, but I'm already starting to like realize that I might be in trouble. And uh, we can take a small hope hit, all right? A small hope hit to get our kids working. That's what we're gonna do. Hear me, hear me. New law in the city. But our children aren't used to working. They'll get hurt. Oh no. We toil all day, and now the kids have to work too. I mean, you guys are literally gonna die if this doesn't happen. So deal with it. Let's get to work. We can't give up now. Yeah, controversial work, but hey, we're living near a fu uh, you're in fighting arena, so the discontent is going down. I wish you could get the chid <laughs> the kids in the uh, the fighting arena. That'd be the way to make this really good. All right, let's actually get our guys going on. Oh, food and hunger. Let's see. Issue yield. Okay, food and hunger. Okay, so hunter's hut is 15 raw food a day. A hot house is, which is like a greenhouse, I assume, is 30 raw food a day. And you make two raw food rations per raw uh, food. Unit, right. I assume that people eat one food unit a day, probably. I'm gonna take a wild guess. Anyway. Look, that'll be fine. Day night cycle, work time, free time, free time, beautiful. Sh swift, sh uh, it's called shift times. Extended shift or emergency shift. Yep, that's fine. Alright. This is all cool. We need to get a medical post. Care house, infirmary. Ah, uh, okay, it's gravely ill can receive radical treatment, but they can receive proper treatment at an infirmary. Okay. Alright. We need to get a bloody uh, medical post going up then. That's our next priority. We'll put it right here. Work time! I mean, there's nothing. Is there any reason we'd rather use. No? No? Kids are just as effective as workers. Alright, beautiful. Oh shit, everyone's starting to get hungry. Kids, cook us meals quick! Oh, shit, a coal pile's been depleted. All right, here. Get this medical post down. We're going to focus... Uh oh oh, I thought fucking crash for a moment. Jesus. Get our NG boys on this one. Wood crate's depleted. God, that was quick. All right, here. Max out these guys. Oh, so children can gather wood as well. I'm not going to get them doing that, though. I want children working in the insides where it's safe. Or safer, at least. So we need to build a workshop and a beacon. However, we do need to get this medical hut up first. Okay, engineers, we need them here. So we go. We're going to go max that stuff out. Max that with NGs. Beautiful. Now we have a functioning hut. Ah, we got three gravely sick people. Shit. Do we let them die, or do we try and radically treat them? Hope will rise slightly. Hope will rise slightly. Look, I think because we can sort of head down, like we only just got them gravely ill because we couldn't get to a uh, thing in time. I think we're going to go sustain life. They'll be kept alive but untreated in medical posts. Hope will rise slightly. Discontent will rise slightly. Uh, ah, discontent rises either way. Fuck it. They're gonna be treated. We're gonna radically treat them. Let's do this. We're gonna fix their shit. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright. Let's get going. Very sparse. Okay, workforce. Let's have a look at this real quick. I oh, know, weather changes. Okay, it gets colder outside. Buildings. That's fine. Okay, workforce. Let's see. Workers provide manual labor. Yeah, okay, we, we know about all this. That's fine. I like how my children are no longer prohibited as well. Nice. What's this? Five being Oh, what is that? 
Oh, I, I think it's just gotten colder. Yeah, it's down to uh, 40 degrees Celsius. Oof. All right, how's our coal reserves doing? We're doing okay. About two days worth of coal reserves. All right. I hope I don't freeze to death on duty. Damn, dude. All right. 144 a day. Right. How much are we bringing back? 18 an hour. How much is that? But I want to know per day, so... Whatever. Look, you guys start taking that stuff out. Are we getting steel still? And let's, um... I want to check this real quick. Economy, right. We're not getting any steel currently. So, I'm going to send, I'm going to send like, a small amount of who to get for steel, because we don't really need that much steel. We're doing fine on steel right now. Treating our sick people. That's fine. What have we got in the way of patience? 22 hours, 2 days. Okay, that's all fine. I wonder if we got any amputees out of that. Generator overdrive. Yeah, basically to heat it up, heat up further. Temperature in all heat zones increases. Oh, that looks beautiful when it turns on. But the stress starts to increase. Alright, let's uh let's see the temperature overlay real quick. Yeah, it's gonna see these areas are livable, but this is cold. Okay. So really we want to go to level two. We need to uh Damn, we, we need to double our coal production as well. Alright, whatever. Kill that stuff. Whatever. It's only cold at least. It's, at least it's not like frozen. Anyway. Okay, you're doing fine. We need to recover the lost expedition. So the next thing to do is a gathering post? We've, no. Workshop. I guess probably it's better like have our workshops further out and our living places closer in. Okay, get a workshop here. So, oh, we could put... No, that's a bad place for it. Let's put it... Not adjacent to street. Okay, so we'd need to extend a street out, but that looks like a better place for it. Okay, here. So, run a street out to it. Beautiful. Okay. Then we need to build the beacon, which I don't think we can actually do yet. What is a gathering hut? Oh, people working here gather from just nearby piles. Oh, that's really good. Okay. Can we put it here? Yeah, we can. Alright. Uh, but I want to have a house there instead. So, let's do exactly that. Let's go... A tent. And then let's build a gathering hut on the outside. But hang on, if we... Oh, oh, I see. Is it like that? Okay. Well... Hang on. Building here will destroy resource sources. Oh, okay, okay. So it doesn't actually work like the way I th thought it would. Alright. Let's stick you here. Gathering hut. So that'll... I assume that's just a way of automating the, uh, the gathering. Food. We've got a cookhouse. That's fine. We just need to wait on the, w the workshop then. Alright. Let's kick on time. Yep, cool. I want to, I like, high priority this. Oh, it's being built. She'll be right. Research. Yep, that's fine. Come on, guys. Let's see our research. Oh, mild frostbite. A citizen became gravely ill. Well, enjoy your trip, then. Oh, what's this? Oh, right. One of our people became ill. To keep happening, people have to work in such cold. I see. Well, such is life. What is this? Child injured at work. No. No, no, no. Scold this kill f Whoa, 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 what? No, give the child a fucking day off, alright? The accident was not serious and happened in Charlie and entirely due to the car child's carelessness. Give this kid a day off. Looks like he fucking ripped his arm up. Jesus! Did drop a fucking cleaver on it. Give him a day off. Relax. Alright. I do like these events. I love these. I love these sort of games. So much fun. Definitely gonna give this a stream tomorrow, but I'm probably rare. It's called Do a Let's Play or something on it as well. I'll probably continue this game for Let's Play. But man, it's a good fun. Alright. If you guys want to see it, that is. Uh, what am I looking at? Okay, workshops. No, gathering post. Where'd the workshop go? Oh, it's over here. Christ, I thought it was over this side for some reason. Right, so we need engineers here. And we can go for heaters, which allow us to heat workplaces during working hours. Okay. Oh, but that's for further... Oh, okay, so it is better to have houses closer in and then workplaces further out. Alright, well, this is something I'm starting to learn. God damn it. Smaller heat zones around them. Okay, all right. Three calling out. This isn't a terrible idea. Is there anything else? Oh, oh, well, yeah, there is other things. Okay. Oh, the beacon. There we go. Beacon. All right. We'll also spot incoming people. The coal thumper. Yes, forming a pile after 560 fucking coal per standard workday. That's a lot of fucking coal. Holy shit. Uh, sawmill. Okay, steelworks. Look, let's just get let's get the beacon first, then we're going after the coal thumper, then the uh, heaters and stuff. All right, let's do this. But we need uh, we need Angie boys. So 
Where are engineers assigned? We've got 15 overall, do we? Alright, 15 engineers. Alright, we need 5 of them. And then we need max. Whoop! Okay, start. Start that shit. Beautiful. Keep gathering on that stuff, that's fine. Got four sick guys. Hang on, if we do this, what's happening? No gathering resources are within range. Well, I mean, you're not even started yet. Anyway, let's get going. But yeah, here's hoping. Okay, that's me about 17 hours. Yeah, we'll get those three researched, uh, those things researched first. We just need, we need more people now. We're starting to run out of uh, places for them to work. Oh, what's this? Family torn apart. Sir, a woman came to us after we built the workshop. She said her husband and daughter didn't reach the city with the main group, but she saw she's still out there. She wants to join the first group we'll send out. She urges you to hurry. We'll do what we can. Okay, well, let's assume like a little quest thing. All right, fuck, why are these people getting gravely sick? We're gonna end up with so many friggin', uh... All right, we, we need to put, like, heaters on this second la layer somehow. I think we don't get... Don't get the workplace heaters, because right now workplace heaters aren't our main concern, I think. What is this? Requires at least one worker. No gatherable resources in range. So did I have to build it within range of something like this? Or is it... Hang on, let me let me just turn this off for now, alright? Get you guys away. Hang on, if we, if we look, let's look at that hut real quick. From nearby coal piles, wood crates, and steel records. So was that from like the coal pile from the coal thumper then, maybe? Is that what, it, is that what it's used for? We'll see when it comes to it. Anyway. We should be doing alright food-wise. Uh, we appear to be, yes. Reading 10 a day. Okay, let's just... Let's put 15 guys in. Let's actually... Uh, I mean, we're doing fine on food. Food's not our trouble, right? We need steel and wood. Alright, and the beacon, obviously, when it gets researched. Okay, tick on time. Let's get this beacon researched. Let's get it up in the sky and bring in some more people. Man, so many people are sick. Okay, new laws, new laws. Something... What can we do? Emergency shift... No, food additives. Okay, sawdust meal available in cookhouse. Um, hope will fall slightly. Well, okay, wow. Apparently, either way we go, people are not going to like it. Wow, apparently, yeah, people are just not going to like this either way. Alright, let's not do that, maybe. People need, still need to raise their spirits with a drink. Um, build a public house. What's the cost of that? 15? I mean, it's not terrible. I might as well I might as well just sign it, and then at some point I'll build it. What about this? Dueling law? Oh shit, what the fuck? Disagreements between people who face deadly threats every day can be solved in a duel? Sometimes people will be killed in a duel. Uh, I'm gonna hold off on getting that shit. Wow. Child labor, all jobs. Oh my god, he's so sad! <laughs> oh no. Oh wait, could I have gone... Oh, so have I gone down a... What's it called? The other path I could have gotten medic apprentices. Damn it, I wanted to get that. Oh. Alright, let's go. Um. I guess. I guess. Let, let's just hold off. I don't think we really need anything just yet. Overcrowding. Um. Double the capacity of medical buildings. Uses extra rations to speed up recovery. Actually, I'd rather that because right now I. Let's, let's do that shit. Extra rations, speed up recovery. Hear me! Hear me! Here, guys. Guys, go extra rations. Because, to be frank, I don't, like, need those rations right now. Like, I'd, I'd rather you have you guys working, so... Alright, that's fine. What do you guys... Make extended bills? That's fine. Cool. Get some children in here. Uh-oh. Oh my god, Jesus. Amputees! Oh no! What happens with these guys? Uh... Amputees help you find solutions to the problem. They can't, okay, they can't work, but they still need to be housed and fed. Why do I feel like the option in a later game, how about the options are either prosthetics and slash or, um, free snow trips. <laughs> okay, we must do something about it. Consider signing the care house or prosthetics law. Yep. Oh boy, oh boy, okay. Care house. Gravely ill are kept in care houses and no longer burden medical posts. Residents of care houses eat half as much. Okay, hope arise. Okay, that's really actually good. Alright, we, we should do this next. It's one day, six hours before we can sign a new law. Alright. It's a very fast moving society. Holy shit. What do you want? Protective mother. She's a free refused to let her go to work. Um let her have a day off. Hope will rise slightly. Thank God. Whew. She'll be right. How are we doing around here? How much longer? Oh, it's obviously. They're taking the research has stopped, I assume, because, yeah, they're closed, right. 
Come on, guys. Let's get this shit going. We're doing fine heat-wise. We just... Oh, so many people are getting sick. Do we just need more, like, fucking... Okay, what is... How many spaces do this place have? Is there anything to say? Oh, there's four, oh, five, and we have 14 sick people. God damn. Alright, beacon. Here we go. Do we want to maybe go... What's the next way to get, uh... Medical post upgrade? Yeah, but... Hmm. Drawing boards? No. Let's get that coal thumper going on. I guess we don't really need coal just yet, do we? Let's probably get steam hub to heat up the areas around them. Sure. Let's let's figure focus on people not getting sick in the first place. All right, that's fine. Let's get the beacon up and going. Here we are. Oh, oh my God, this is big. Um, it can go here because it doesn't need to be heated for now. Actually, here next to these guys. Oh, there's a weird. That's a weird lag. I don't know if that's part of my recording software or whatever, but. I want to see, uh, oh yeah, it needs to be adjacent to a street, right, hang on. I do like the street building in this, here we go, so, bonk. There we go. Alright, take on some time, we'll see this built. God damn it, people are starting to get even sicker. A frightened patient, one of our people is facing death, but he's still refusing amputation. He keeps screaming, he doesn't want anyone to touch his leg, and he won't change his mind. Let him be. I'm not fast, I don't like, an amputee's not gonna help, I'd rather he either die or live. And he... Oh, did he live? Oh, he lived. Okay. We will no longer be lost and blind. From now on, people will be able to survey the icy barrens around us. The Frostlands. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is fucking cool. Oh, is it just detached completely? Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, there is still a cable, right. Whoa. Lost Expedition Observatory. Wow, I did not realize this game was like this. Send scouts here. Uh, what about here? This peculiar building must be the Royal... The Arctic Observation uh, Observatory the Royal Society built to investigate the eternal winter. There's smoke over it. Okay. Go directly to the beacon deploying moon unit. Build an outpost depot to deploy outpost teams. Okay, there's outpost teams. What? Create a new scout team? Let's do that. Fuck yeah. I want to send these guys to the Lost Expedition. You go. Alright, scouts number one. We're sending out a scout team. Does it actually doesn't require people, does it? Huh. We can build outposts? This is fucking cool. So I guess, can we just not... I guess we can't... So with that, the actual, like, sending out people doesn't actually require people, does it? Oh no, shit, it does. It requires workers. Oh fuck, okay, right. I say that's weird, but... Okay, damn. Damn, son. Alright, alright, alright. We're doing fine. What, what's here? What's happening? Ready to search. People cheer as the giant observation balloon soars over the city. This is a real feat. Everyone feels proud of the work they've done to make it happen. Volunteers have lined up, eager to go looking for our lost people in the Frostlands. The one who came along earlier is, uh, is among them. We needed a win. Beautiful. Alright. Five being treated and zero in public care. Three amputees. Oh, oh, God. We have so many sick people. Oh boy, I should have moved more people closer. What is this? First death. Oh, there we go. We need a way to dispose of the body. Open the Book of Laws. Okay. Corpse disposal. Doing it. I want a snow pit. Oh, wait, hang on. Out of this. Ah, oh, actually, I was, I was hoping to like to burn them actually. Um. No risk of disease. Bodies are preserved for potential future use. Alrighty then. Okay, game. Alright. Oh, painful death. He died of gangrene, but he suffered terribly in the end. Oh, what? Oh, wow. Okay, so it was just a bad choice overall. God damn it. Okay, discontent will rise slightly. Fuck it. Oh boy, we're not doing great. Oh, I really should have I really should have put the homes all closer here. But man, we just need to we need to increase the steam level too, so bad. To increase the area. 2 plus heat in all steam zone in all heat zones. Unless maybe uh, maybe this only heats this area and we need to we do need to build the other ones elsewhere. The beacon scouts are self-sufficient and can venture great deals. That's fine. Oh, sorry, great distances rather. Alright, cool. Come on then. I wanna I wanna like wrap this up with a uh oh, wood crate's depleted. Here we go, what's this? More sick bed needed. I'm aware, I'm aware. I will open 
a new medical post. Let's do it. Fucking Christ. Here, yeah, just right here, right behind the last one. Unless... Fuck, actually, I just realized this is wasted space. I thought we'd have to leave room for stuff, but no, it's not. Shit, okay, um... Here, because I'm going to heat it up soon enough. So there we go, put that there. Extend that out, beautiful. Alright, the wood crates are depleted. We need to do a sawmill soon enough. Actually, we can put these guys out to here. Here we go, ten guys go chasing them. We've got eleven child workers that we could spend somewhere. Is there anyone else we can send them? Oh, children can actually gather here, but there's nothing to gather just yet. Right. Okay, let's actually- I want to see what this, um, what these scouts find. Wisdom of the crowd. When facing demands, look at this. Look for the quicker solution- Oh, people usually look for the quicker solution, not the best one. You don't have to agree with everything they ask for. Okay, right. Coal is still being fine. We're still gathering up loads of that. Oh, where are you guys going? What the fuck? What the fuck? Hmm. Okay. Sure thing. Oh, scouts have reached the lost, lost expedition. Lovely, right, here we go. Exploration. They will await your orders. Here we go, waiting. So. Oh, hang on. I want to see, I want to see, hang on. The rest of our people may camp here. Too exhausted to go on. We should escort them to the city. Yes, explore. We enter the camp, appearing out of the driving snow. A choir of excited voices welcome us. Thank God you found us. We've been wandering for days and we can't go on any longer. Soon we'd starve. Okay, children are not surround us. We're packed and ready to go. Crash site, stu uh, sturdy shelter. Okay. Send them to the city or escort them to the city. Okay. Survivals will set out on their own. It may take longer. No, I'd rather bring them quickly and safely. All right, let's let's not do that. Let's escort the survivors to the city. There we go. I assume I could keep sending on. Yeah, okay, right. So if I'd sent my guys on, I could have kept checking out other places, but right now I'm just bringing back populace. Populace, rather. All right, let's speed on time. Let's see those guys arrive. Oh, I do love a little beacon. I wish I could see more of it. Let's, let's do this. Ah, oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Lovely times. This game is great fun, actually. I'm really enjoying it already. I thought I've, oh, I can already clearly see the multiple mistakes I've made regarding the uh, the way this works. We see more engineers as well. Holy shit! All right, well, there we go. I guess five more engineers here. We need we need some way to make more engineers. This is the biggest problem right now. Okay, and how long until okay steam hub is soon? If we can put a steam hub like right here, this will fix a lot of our problems. Heats up the workshop, heats up the medical post, more houses will get heated up as well. It's just it's what we need. You got what I need. Um, it's nice. It's like this is nice, but it's just not going to do enough. Look, like it's we need we need more range on this thing, which is something you can get, but. Oh, oh, good, right, consumption and, and production, right. You hope the sick, hope rises. Perfect, 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 perfect. Oh, it's warmed up slightly, nice. Still a shit place to be. Hey, there we go, you can disband the scouts of the beacon or send them back into the frost band. I shall send them back. What is happening? Oh, shit. That's fucking cool. It's heartwarming to see families reunited after so many hardships. But shouldn't there be other settlements nearby? The first expeditions left London long ago. They ought to be well established by now. They will surely help us find our footing. We will look for others. That's fucking cool. I really do enjoy that. I think we might leave it there. I think that's a very good ending point. So thank you for watching. Let me know if you want to see more of this. I will probably be streaming this um, today, actually, probably. Wait, is this video going? Yeah, this. so probably in like two hours there'll be a stream. Um, but yeah. I really fucking enjoy this. Um, really good game, really well made. I can already see the poor choices I've made. There's clearly different paths you can go down. Yeah, let's um, let's uh, continue on playing this. It's good fun. All right, farewell.